My name is Saurabh Din Ambiar. I am from Delhi. I did my schooling from Sarvam Public School, Mohir Vihar. Thereafter, I went for my engineering in Mangalore, which is in the field of mechanical engineering. I come from a family which has a, which has a lot of engineers and doctors. I did, I pursued bachelor's in mechanical engineering. After my engineering was over, there were a few things that I had lined up. I always wanted to do my master's. So I started taking classes for IELTS. I got IELTS 7.5. And after that, I started applying for a lot of universities like Northeastern, Case Western Reserve University. University of Texas Arlington and Arizona State University. So these were good universities and I received offer letter for mechanical engineering from Northeastern University. I couldn't pursue it at that time because even though I was approaching for loan from Empower and uh, Prodigy, they, the loan amount was not good enough to uh, support my two-year tenure at Boston. It was kind of expensive. Thereafter, I almost lost all hope. So. I started working uh, with Sign for their Pratt & Whitney project. I was taking care of around 200 to 250 aircrafts on daily basis in the aerospace domain because I wanted, always wanted to do masters in aerospace. So when I get a job, got a job which was Pratt & Whitney being the second largest jet engine manufacturer in the world, this is the option that I have to take. Even though when I was working for an aerospace company, I realized most of my work was tied closely to analytics domain and this was the tilting point or the pivot point that I had in my life. Coming from an entrepreneurship background and coming from a technical background at the same time, like if I pursue something in this regards would have been a good option for me. So that's what I thought. So that's when I got in touch with Futurence's US Pathway program where we would actually do a course from IIT IM which would, which would cover 30% of the entire course. So those 30% of the credits would be transferred to US, your university there. So when I, back in 2021, uh, I was applying for Case Western where I was rejected for aerospace engineering. Futurence also had that option to for me to apply at the same university. I told the Futurence guys, I told my counselor that I I have to only apply for Case Western, none other. And they were very positive about it, okay. They looked into my profile. Even though I had 1.9 years of experience, Case Western was asking for two years of experience minimum. I still got into, I got the application. Uh, I did my application, I went through the application process. In under a month, I received my offer letter. I was extremely happy with it. And the other factors that I liked about Futurance was that I was doing 30% of my course here in India because of which the total uh, time of my course shifted from 16 months to 12 months. The credit transfer that was happening from the IIT IM course that I was going to do in India, when it was transferring to my degree in uh, US, I was only paying fees for those 12 months instead of paying for 16 months. Thereafter, I did my deposit of 20,000 and after that, I started my application with them and it went smoothly.